104.7 The K, Mike the Intern, in the studio this morning with my two best friends in the whole world from the Springfield Regional Arts Council, Rachel and what was your name again? Sarah. <laughs> That's right. Remember that anyway. time you were like, I don't say rude things to you? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> you set me up for that. Anyway, uh, we're here today to talk about a really cool yearly award show that the Arts Council is a part of called the Aussies. You might not know about this, but it is a, it's basically a way that we can say thank you to those of uh, businesses, individuals, uh, nonprofits, artists that are in this community that give back not only their time, their money, or their talents to mm -hmm. what we're all trying to do here is boost the arts up in the Ozarks. That's all it's about. And this is a way for us to say thank you to those people. And the best part is you can actually go. Anybody can go. Yeah. Yes. Tickets yeah. are on sale now. And like Mike said, this is this is the best way to really understand the full scope of what the arts are doing for our local community, whether it be through volunteer service, by doing great events like Arts Fest, or just putting on shows free for the community. One of our nominees, this uh, Springfield... The, the Springfield Symphony out. Orchestra. Yes, they do free yearly concerts for mm -hmm. kids multiple times during the year, and a lot of people don't know about that. So we use our megaphone as the Arts Council to just amplify everything that these amazing finalists are doing. Um, and you can be a part of it to find out who wins just by buying a ticket. And it's at the airport. It is yes. at the airport. We are and I know the you're only thinking, well, that, what are you guys doing? But it's actually really cool that they do this event in the airport. It is. The airports are huge supporters of the arts. Um, we actually curate the selection at the art port. If you've been to the, the airport here in town, all of the amazing art that's actually selected by us and hung. Um, and it's all on display and curated just to support this event. So it's really cool. Yeah. So tickets are $100 and go are, are on sale um, until Thursday. Mm -hmm. And um, we're basically just throwing a big party. Let's celebrate what Springfield has done for the arts. And this, this money year. goes back into... It goes back to the, the Springfield yeah, Regional Arts that's Council exactly to what support it's all, about. all of our educational programming, um, which a lot of after school programming for kiddos, um, a lot of teaching artists, a lot of camps, things like that that we support. Um, you'll be able, for that $100, you'll get a great cocktail hour. You'll get a fantastic dinner. You'll get performances from Springfield Little Theater, Springfield Contemporary Theater, our local opera company, Paper Moons, and much, much more. And uh, I guess I'll just say it. I'm hosting this thing, <laughs> which is a huge mistake on your part. But for the low, low price of 100 bucks, you can not only benefit the arts in Springfield, but you can also watch me make a complete ass of myself for a couple hours on stage in front of a bunch of people that have a lot more money than I do. Which we can't wait. That in We're itself is excited. worth the price of admission. <laughs> Just that in itself. Get to see Mike what on Mike's stage. What Mike's going to do and what Mike's going to say. What's he going to do? I don't do? know. <laughs> Depends on what my, my kind of Mike wakes up that morning. <laughs> I'm like nervous but excited should at be the good same nervous. time. It's like I describe it to my kids. Like It's like before I do anything, I always picture myself. You know that bridge over Springfield Lake, the yes. defunct one? We uh -huh. used to jump on. Kids, don't do this. Please don't do this. <laughs> please, 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 please don't do this. Parents, if you're listening, I said don't do this. But when I was a kid, we used to jump off that thing into the river, into the lake. It's actually James kind of right there. But uh, I still feel the same way every time I do everything. It's like, I'm like, oh, my God, I can't believe. It. And then I just do it. That's how I do it. You know, so that's how it's going to go. It's going to so it's going to be great. Maybe I'll land on a Brit on a branch that's floating and hurt myself. Or I might just nose drive straight in there and it'll be a 10. Who knows? I can't think of a better, more supportive community for you to get up in front of to make a a fool out of yourself. Absolutely. Be great. It, if it goes bad, they're going to clap and support you anyway. If it goes great, which is what's going to happen, <laughs> then you'll have an even more of an in with the arts community uh, than you do. We'll and see. who knows what's next? Who knows? I, maybe I'll just be the, the Ozarks award show host going forward. You could. After oh, the job it I only. Do. <laughs> For the low, low price you, of nothing. <laughs> <laughs> For our love and drinks. Yes. yes. Uh, yeah. Um, I'll have to get a taxi or an Uber home after this one. Uh, again, Aussies coming up this Saturday. If you want to buy your tickets and support Arts in the Ozarks, get them before Thursday. Where can they get them at? Uh, Springfieldarts.org slash Aussie dash awards. That's it. Get your tickets. Ladies, I'll see you on Saturday. Awesome. Thanks, Mike.